Meantime, parents in City Heights say an elementary school crosswalk is just too dangerous for students. They tell us distracted drivers constantly speed through the area. They asked CBS 8 for help and our own Ariana Cohen got to work. Yes, I talked to multiple parents and neighbors who say this school crosswalk is dangerous. I reached out to the school district to see what can be done to make it safer. There's so many cars that just fly by. Did you do this with your, as my hand? Uh huh. Come on. Chelsea Garland took this cell phone video as she and her four year old son walked to Herbert Ibarra Elementary School when she says he almost got hit by a car. My heart dropped. Like really, it was really scary because there's nothing I could do at that point. I feel like the issue is that um, when we're crossing the street, whether the lights are flashing or not, people speed like it's not a school zone. I talked to other people crossing the street who feel the same way. Someone was about to run me over right now. I'm not even joking. But as soon as I was crossing the street, he like, drove really fast. People here say the crosswalk at Orange Avenue and 49th needs a crossing guard. They say it's also dangerous at Orange and Estrella Avenue. Garland says it will also be helpful to have San Diego police monitoring drivers speeds along these streets. Hi, this is Ariana Cohen calling from CBS 8. I contacted the San Diego Police Department and have not heard back. I did speak with officials from the school district and made them aware of what parents are seeing. They say it's early in the school year, but they will address it. <laughs> Meanwhile, parents are hoping to make these crosswalks safer sooner rather than later. I just feel like they don't value everybody's lives that are, you know, trying to cross and get across the street. Please help us. Help us, please. We need your help. Working for you, Ariana Cohen, CBS 8. Thank you, Ariana. And here at CBS 8, we want to help solve problems that are affecting you. If there's something you'd like us to look into, please email us at workingforyou at cbs8.com.